What happened? The Glock 9000. The Glock 9000. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another one of our videos. Kylan? So I wanted to get on here because uh, Kylan has... Say hi. Say what's up? So Kylan has this mark on his arm. I'll post some pictures here on the screen. Never mind, she deleted them. Like from uh, Erica, she took it the first time. Okay. <laughs> but as you can see, he's good. Uh, everything's fine. He doesn't seem to like have any type of like irritation. Say hi. Say hello. Say hi. Go say hi. You wanna go say hi to everyone? No? <laughs> he said hi. Okay, come back. <laughs> yeah, see he's fine. Nothing's really bothering him, but let me show you guys like what it looks like now. Here. Can we show them your, your arm? Can we show your arm? Yeah, let me uh, turn you guys. So like, that's what his arm looks like. That's what his arm looks like now. He's not really gonna let me do it, but he kind of looks like a, a burn. We don't really know exactly like how he got it. Erica's the one that noticed it. The motion. I thought that it was um a bug bite or like a spider had bit him or something. Yeah. Um, because it was red like a pimple at first, but now it's like kind of dry-ish. Yeah, so it's I like think scabbing. maybe. Mm -hmm, it's scabbing. So I think maybe. <laughs> Maybe he like burnt himself or something. I don't know how. Maybe he burnt himself. I don't know. Maybe he touched the oven. I don't know. No. We, he's never unattended, so I don't know how it, it would be a burn. But it doesn't hurt or anything like that. Like I've been putting hydrocortisone cream on it, and he's been letting me touch it and like poke at it, or whatever. And so. Yeah, because at first it didn't look like it didn't bubble up like a burn. You know? Yeah. Oh that. yeah. Like that's if he if he got burnt, it would have bubbled up. But it didn't bubble up. It started off like a, you know when you get bit by a mosquito, yeah. Then it kind of just gets red a little bit. Yeah. It was just like that for a little bit. So Erica was taking pictures of his mark like every day and just to see if it got worse. Because if it did get worse, we'd take him to the hospital or set an appointment to see what it is. But, I like the lighting in Kylan's room. Yeah, Kylan has really good lighting. But yeah, he's fine. <gasps> oh my god. Freaking trying to chug my monster, dude! Oh my god! Are you okay? He's Look, like, he's why did you take it away? No, it's okay. You can't drink this one yet. <laughs> Walking on his knees. Okay. You can't drink this one. Okay. Yeah. You can hold it. You can hold it. You can't drink. Oh, oh shoot! Oh. Okay. Apparently, you can't hold it either. It's okay. Okay, okay, okay. Look, look, look. I have a card. I have a card. Go with it. Okay, are we done? Are we done? He runs to his mama because he knows. He is mama boy. He is a mama boy. Today is Father's Day, so I actually forgot today was Father's Day. Erica reminded me, and I probably would have found out myself from like just social media, and I'd be like, hey, wow, you forgot today's Father's Day. Wow. 
such a great mother. I I knew. I knew the whole time. I know. But uh, Erica's treating me to some Captain George's tonight. Some crab legs. You good now? What does it mean? Clean yourself up. Clean yourself up. Are you okay? Oh. Ow, don't pick your nose. <laughs> He's mad at you, babe. Okay. Oh! Honey, mad? I'm sorry. Oh, shit. Girl, you burned it. I burnt the bagel. Oh, my God. See, this is why we can't leave her nowhere. Oh, my God. I'm going to cry. That was my last. This is not burnt. Erica claims this is burnt. That's burnt. That is not burnt. That is toasted. Coco always, like, tries to, like, peck at Kylan. And Kylan's so, like, nice to him. Say, Coco. Look at Coco. Coco. Coco, you're a jerk. Be nice to Kylan. Look at him. He's, like, freaking plotting to, like, attack him. Coco, stop it. Kylan's never even, like, stop it. tried to hit Coco okay. or anything. Kylan actually learned how to climb up his high chair on his own. Like, we're gonna try to get him to do it right now. Oh, I think guys. I did. I recorded it. You did? Yeah. Let me get it again. Kylan! Look, Kylan! Nah, nah. Wow, he doesn't care. This is Kylan's favorite thing ever. Like, he will jump off a bridge for this. Alright, I'm giving your Nana the Coco. Ah! <laughs> Boy! Nana? Nana Coco? Kylan, come here! Coco, get your Nana! Nana, go in the, sit. Did you get Nana? Okay. Hey, look at those bat games. Okay. All right. And that's it. Come on, you got it. Yay! Good job. Thing, dude. Okay, here you go. Open it. Kylan loves bananas. So he says that's how nana. It it, yeah, that's how it started. But now everything, like whenever he's hungry, he says nana. But that's his way of telling us that he's hungry. Look, why does he eat the cracker like that? <laughs> <laughs> he eats it like <laughs> in a, such a weird way. I don't know why he does that. That's like eating a taco at the top, <laughs> not the side. I just got back from the mall because I was getting a shirt for Father's Day picture and then. This package, this package was outside. I think this is off of a registry for Kylan's uh, baptism because Kylan's getting baptized this coming weekend. So super excited for that. I think you're just like... Hey, kill me. Hey, kill me. Why are you watching ASMRs? They kill me. Is she alive? Oh, hello. Babe. Babe, a package came for Kylan's registry, I think. You want to open it later? Okay. Okay. You guys already know I'm about to open this. Kylan, happy baptism. Hope you enjoy the gift from Alan and Tanya. So this is from uh, Erica's uncle, Yvonne, and Aunt Tanya. What? What is it? Got some wheat. What is this? It's a learning tower. Interesting. I have no clue what that is. I got her out of bed, but what is it? It's a learning tower. What does it do? It's like, um, it's used in the Montessori method sometimes for kids. They click crawl up in it, I guess, and they can stand and help you do activities like on the counter. Ah. So, like they can do activities on the counter or help cook on the counter or mm -hmm. even teach them how to wash their hands, stuff like that. It's just like uh, a tower. And they stand on it and it has railings to prevent them from For him to hold. Okay. That's cool. He can use that to climb up the toilet and take his own dump. So we ain't got to wipe his butt no more. It is later on in the day and we are about to go do a grocery haul. We recently started doing grocery shopping at Aldi's and it's been saving us a lot of money. And we're going to take you guys along with us and just show you like the difference. Like usually we spend like 150 right at Wegmans. Yeah, or but, more. Yeah, a little bit more than that. So we, uh, we end up usually... We end up usually only spending about 110 the most at Aldi, so let's head out. This whole learning tower here is new. Uh, we got it off of our registry for Kylan's uh, baptism party, and 
coming soon erica like put this all together and did like a whole video with it that's gonna be on her channel on my channel so stay tuned for that it's coming soon whenever she's gonna edit it <laughs> Look at this cashews for three forty-nine. Cashews this size at Wegmans is like almost ten bucks. What are you doing? Ready, ready? Whoosh! Kind of likes these cards because like it has like this little dangly thing, and he thinks it's a toy. Bye. Later. <laughs> Great. I just love how neat everything is. Bye. And it's like that, like I don't really give a F mentality. They just like throw the boxes on and just rip off the top. What you got there? It's the buffalo style chicken breast. Why are you whispering? I'm not whispering. <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> she got the honey turkey breast. No, it's buffalo. Buffalo? Where's that one? It's chicken. Oh. Ah. Chicken breast. Oh, buffalo chicken. Yeah, it's so good. In the morning. Some mozzarella, like melted on top. Like a bagel? Avocado. Yeah. I also love it here too because I can get a ribeye steak for pretty dumb cheap. Like one of these, this size would be 20 bucks, and this one is 15. What are y'all doing? You spitting on mama? Then we're gonna get some applewood bacon, and we already got a pack of these, and for this pack alone is $6.75. This would be about 10 bucks at Wegmans, and it's really good. You got your steak right there? Yeah, and sour cream, look at that. Boom, 79 cents, baby. But the thing with this sour cream, I, I don't know if it was just me, it had like a weird texture to it. It wasn't smooth, it felt kind of grainy for some reason. I think it's just mm -hmm. Maybe we just got a bad one. Of course, we got to get the eggs. Probably gonna get two packs of these. Just because we went through our other one so fast. And these are, can you guys guess the price? Guess the price, guess the price. 59 cents each. What is our total? Okay, so our total was 76.39, which is amazing for us because we always go over $120. I feel like we got more of this thing. So, what the heck is that? Successful shopping. Successful shopping. <laughs> Save your coin. We are home now. We got all the groceries here. Erica had to run to Food Lion to get these Carb Smart ice creams. So good and super low in carbs. But we are going to wrap it up for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys can, smash that like button. And if you guys are new to the channel, welcome to the channel. Hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications. Until the next video, what do you say, Kyla? Say bye bye. Say peace out. Oh god, you okay? What do you do? <laughs> he just bumped his head now. Okay, bye. Oh.